Hey y'all, it's Lady C in the place to be. No. CJ, no. No. Oh, start my video off and he's growling at somebody outside. Hey y'all, it's Lady C in the place to be. Lady C's hoes and all. I am here today. I am here today, y'all. And I have the remainder of, I think I don't, yeah. This is the last of my hauls that I had at the house, okay? From all the stuff I had. Um, I am going to possibly do a walkthrough today and do some shopping. So let's get into it. Um, don't have a lot. Um, I have some Dollar Tree and then I have some items that I picked up at our local grocery store, the grocery outlet. So I'm gonna show you that too. All right, let's go, y'all. Oh yeah. Um, let's start off with food. So the first couple items, I didn't have a lot of food from Dollar Tree, but I had some items. I went to the grocery store next door to Dollar Tree, which is the grocery outlet. Um, and I really do like it. I hope that they stay in our neighborhood. Um, I hope they're getting enough business to stay in our neighborhood. I like them. Um, they, they have everything I need, but I mean, the prices are great. Some of the prices are comparable to Dollar Tree. Um, so if I don't get it from Dollar Tree, I get it over there. Or some of it is more expensive, so I make sure I get it from Dollar Tree, if that makes sense. Anyway, one of the things I did get, because I was running out of broth, and I forgot to get it from Dollar Tree, and I was in there anyway, so I picked it up. Um, as long as the price makes sense, you guys, let me just say this before I say anything else. As long as the price makes sense, I don't care where I get it from. I love Dollar Tree. I'm always going to shop there. But if the price makes sense somewhere else, I'm going to get it. So it is what it is. Um, this is the Swanson, the chicken broth in the can. I didn't get the full blown, you know, the big, big, uh, what do they call that? Like a pouch or whatever of it. Um, but I needed some chicken broth. We're always using it. My husband's always cooking. This is 14 and a half ounces. And I don't know, this might've been like a dollar something. I can't remember. Um, so it made sense where I was at. I picked it up. Actually, I picked up two of them because I needed some chicken broth. We use chicken broth in a lot of things, y'all. Um, then they have a very good, what they call ethnic area, where they have like um, cultural foods, like noodles and Hispanic foods. And they have a lot of that. They also have a lot of natural food products. Um, and I was really surprised. That's kind of why I like them. But anyway, I picked these up. Um, the other day, hubby got a lot of the noodles from the Asian grocery store, but they do carry a lot of noodles in the grocery outlet. So this is shin black. You get four bags. It's shin black with beef bone broth and they're noodles. And I love any kind of different noodle, you guys. I'd never seen these, these shin black. So I went ahead and got these because we're going to try them out. Um, I want to say these were like $4.99 for the bag, which was fine with me. Cause you're getting four of them for $4.99, which I was fine with. So we're gonna try these out. We eat a lot of noodles. We make different meals with them. Um, you know, we just, we like noodles. Hubby also likes them like this. So I picked up two of these. This also came from the grocery outlet. This, they're by Nong Shim. It says Nong Shim Premium Shin Black with Beef Bone Broth. It's the same black noodles but this is in this type of container where you can, um, I think you can microwave. Yeah, you can microwave it or just use hot water. So I picked up two of these because Hubby likes to take them to work. Um, I picked this up from the grocery outlet. I think this is the last thing. My husband loves these Ricolas. Now, you can get them from the Dollar Tree, but I happened to not see any in there that day. So I went ahead and picked them up at the grocery outlet. Now at Dollar Tree, they would be $1.25. I want to say these were probably close to the same price, like a dollar something, or else I wouldn't have picked them up. So I picked them up. These are the net original herb ones, but I've also seen uh, some with a flavor and he likes those too. So I picked them up. He eats these like candy. He loves them. Weird, because I can't stand them. Um, okay, let's continue with some of the food. Now I picked some things up for the doggy. I had finally found these and I had been on the hunt for them. Uh, these are the Treat Bar for Dogs Buddy Finger and it's Spunky Pup, all natural ingredients, creamy peanut butter and contains no chocolate. So it's supposed to be a dupe of the Butterfinger, but for the dog and it's all good for them. I picked that up. 
Then they had Trix, which I'm guessing is supposed to be like Twix for the dog. And this is Treat Bar for Dogs, same cup as Spunky Pup. And all natural ingredients, wholesome oats and honey. Okay, contains no chocolate. So I picked that one up. So those are for you know who, I'm not gonna say his name because he'll come running in here. Um, he will, we'll see how he likes those. These, I picked up two packs of these. Me and my husband are loving these, you guys. These are so sturdy and good, we love them. Um, I hope I can go back out. They had a whole display of them in my store last week. If you saw my walkthrough, you saw me uh, seeing they had the bowls. They had the compostable, the oval plates, which I really like, but you only get six. I'm like, I want more, but that's just me being greedy. Um, they had the compostable oval plates. They had the straws, and I think, oh, what else did they have, y'all? I don't know. I had to go back to the video, but... Anyway, we love these. We've been using these and I've been picking them up. These are the serve bowls and they're eight. You get eight of these um, compostable everyday bowls, 12 ounces, soak resistant, cut resistant, temperature resistant, and microwave safe. These are good. I picked up two, but hubby's already opened the other one. So that tells you something. Um, I did pick these up because I thought this was a value because you're getting 50. Um, it was the 50 extra strong compostable white straws and they're eight inches you're getting 50 that's a good deal for a dollar 25 i really need to like hoard up on these because i know everybody's going to kill them soon um but yeah i picked those up um they're recyclable they're earth friendly and they're non-toxic so i picked those up um does it say anything else y'all the name of the company is zumi innovations and they're made in china he won't let anybody, y'all, and I mean anybody. If they come close to my home, he's not having it. So he really is not the type of dog that will hurt somebody. He just is very protective of me. Um, if you're not bothering me, he's good. You know, he'll let somebody come up on me. Like, he's barking now. But if somebody came in the house, he's good if I'm good. If I'm like, hey, who are you? Get back. And that, then you might have a problem. <sighs> Excuse me. Anyway, I still do pick these up. Um, oh, that was what they had. They had the cutlery in the Serve brand also. But it was only like, it wasn't that many in the box. It was forks, spoons, and knives. And it might have been a set of six or something like that. And we don't use the forks, spoons, and knives. I like to buy my um, cutlery individual like this. I bought. I needed spoons, so I bought a whole box of spoons. Um... I needed spoons, so I bought a whole box of spoons, the 52 count of spoons. I like to do that. Then I'll go back and buy the 52 count in this brand of the, of the forks when I need them. I don't buy knives because we don't usually news, use plastic knives. So it's usually, usually just forks and spoons. It's I just think it's a pain for me to buy the whole set and then not get enough. I mean, the 52 is very good with me. So I picked up 52 count of the spoons. I passed up the serve cutlery because I got all three and I didn't need that. Okay, last food item that I picked up. We ran out of garlic powder, you guys, and we use garlic powder like on everything. If we don't, excuse me, if we don't use garlic powder, we're using real garlic, chopped garlic. We love garlic, okay? Um, so this is garlic powder by Supreme Traditions. It's 2.5 ounces. I know you guys have seen this in Dollar Tree. I pick it up all the time, so I had to pick up one of these. Boro. Okay, onward. We don't have that much. Um, let's go into health and beauty. Um, I picked up some of the under eye patches the other day, and they seem to work. I mean, I'm not going to say I don't have any dark circles because I do. I've had them all my life. Um, but I picked some the other day, the other day and it did, it did something. I don't know. Um, but these I picked up. I never tried these. These are the Global Beauty Care retinol hydrogel hydrogel under eye pads anti-wrinkle serum serum 15 minute eye therapy renew restore revive and you only get one pair um and i thought maybe hey we'll try these and see what they do and i'm guessing you only use them once i'd like to get like more than one pack like one in a pack but what can you say for a dollar 25 so i just bought one to see how they work out then I found these, which I've never, ever seen. Now, I've seen 
the real veggie farm uh, face mask. I don't remember the different types I've had. I gave some away for Christmas, gave some as just gifts to people. These I found the other day in my local store, and these are real veggie farm for the skin superfood double shot mask, and it's the camellia mask. Camellia? Now they got flower masks, you guys. Like, I've never seen anything like that. A flower mask. So I picked it up. Um, and then here's the Real Veggie Farm Double Shot Mask in Beat. Now, I've seen, I've seen people hauling all different ones. So I picked this up. So I picked up one of each because I am not a mask girl. These will be donations to other people, prizes that I give away. You know, so you may be getting one of these. <laughs> Okay, now let's move on to the summer. Summer, summer is here. Well, it ain't quite here because it's for reason here in Maryland today. Um, but it was very nice the other day. Wait a minute. Okay, now we good. Okay, so let's get into the shore living of it all. I showed you guys into my prior hole. I picked up just a little bit of shore living. I'm trying to not go crazy with it because that's really not the design of my house. I do have some of it in my um, master bedroom, master bathroom that I got last year. So I'm just improving upon what I already have, basically. Um, I saw these and I thought they were so cute. They're just called them decor. And these are short living. I think this is so cute. It's like a really shiny look to it. I don't know what, there it is. Can you guys see that? That's the shine that it has. That is just so pretty. I thought this, this would be cute in my bathroom. One of my bathrooms, I don't know, we'll see. Oh, I forgot you guys, I had another face mask. Anyway, this is what I need for something else. Um, I also picked up this face mask. This is Global Beauty Care Sunflower and Honey Brightening Sheet Mask with Brightening Serum, Niacinamide, Vitamins A, C, and E, and you get one sheet mask. And I said, well, maybe brightening will help my under my eyes, so I may use this one. Anybody has used it, tell me what you think of the results. Anyway, so yeah, back to Shore Living. Um, I showed you this one, that's cute. Now, since I love that, I got the match to it. Excuse my dog for sneezing. Um, I got the match to it, and this was in blue. Look how pretty the blue is, y'all. Look at the shine. This is what I want to show you. See the shine? Oh, and look at, the, look at the deep design. You can see it, and it feels it has a texture. Oh, my God, this is nice, y'all. When I saw it in the store, I was like, this is mine. Yes. I'll be the first to probably break it. I break everything. But these, the other one has a texture too. I didn't notice it. It, it comes out more on the blue. So I picked oh. up both of those. CJ. Oh, my dog, y'all. Okay. So let's get into some more shore living real quick. Now, they had these in the shore living. And they call these metal fish wall decor. Metal fish wall decor. Now, I've already, remember, I've already used some Shore Living last year, okay? So I have these colors in my bathroom already, and my bathroom is blue and gray, almost exactly these colors. So I bought the fish. These are metal. I'm going to hang these on the wall and make some kind of design with these. I bought them in the blue and the silver. I just think these are so cute to, together. You know, like hang them like that. Like that, like that, some kind of way on my wall. Then, to go with them, I'm going to make a whole design out of this now. I bought the gray and white, what are they calling these? Metal wall decor. I don't know what the spoggy shells. I bought these, the silver and the blue, in these little shell designs. So, I'm going to do it, you know, like some kind of way, mix these up. You know, we're going to do it. We're going to mix them up and hang them on my wall. And when I do, I'll come back and show you guys how I do it. We're gonna see how it all works out. Now the trash man is outside, you guys, so you may hear a lot of barking because CJ can't let them get by. More Shore Living. This was the last one on the shelf. This is the LED Coastal Pillar Candle. And nobody pulled the tag yet, which I don't really wanna pull it either. But, well, I wanna show you guys what it's looking like, so let me. This is what it looks like. This is so, I thought this was so pretty. Look at that, y'all, look at that. Ooh, the sea turtle. 
Ooh, and all the sea um, plants. Yes, it's beautiful. Then on the bottom, you got to pull the tag, you know, to get it to light up. And then it's got the switches on the bottom. And then there's the light. I don't want to light this yet, y'all. I'm sorry that y'all want to see it. Because I want to see it too, but I'm not ready to do it yet. Isn't that crazy? Well, let's, let's see. Let's see. Let's pull it. And let's turn it on. Ooh, yeah. Oh, it shows the sea turtle so pretty. Look at that, y'all. Oh, my God. Look at the plants. Oh, I'm loving this. It's going in my bathroom. Very, very pretty. Very pretty, y'all. So this, actually, when I got it, was the last one on the shelf. People are not playing with that short living and all the summer items. They're buying it up, y'all. So get in your store. Last item from short living I picked up, and I think that's it. Unless I see something else outstanding. Um, these are the, what are they calling them? Jar with lid and straw. Now, everybody was going crazy over the clear ones with the wood tops. I am not a big wood girl. Like, I don't have wood in my home. I'm not a wood. I mean, I have wood floors. That's about it. Um, I don't do wood decor. So, I wasn't too happy with the wood. So, I said, well, you know, I love this blue. It's gorgeous. Um, and I don't, I don't like the fact that the top is plastic and the straw is plastic. I don't know. I would, I'm going to do something else with this, but that's what it does. It comes up like that and it locks and then it's got a plastic blue top. Now, I don't know what I'm going to do with this, but I want to do something with it. Something special. People were talking about putting, um, like stickers on them or doing something. I don't know, but I'm going to do something with this. I'll show you if I do it, it'll be a DIY and you know, I'm going to show you. Okay, last items. These are my summer items. Now, I showed y'all I had bought a um, runner for my outside table for my deck. I bought a runner. It's like one of those felt runners they had out for the summer. And it's green, like an evergreen, dark green. So I'm going to put that across my table um, on my deck for the summer. So I saw these. And I know everybody else saw them. They were in green and gold. These are the placemats. I didn't want the gold, but I wanted the green to go on my table along with my runner. And this just looks tropical to me. So we're going to have the little drink, the tropical drink cups, the tropical runner, and then I'm going to have the tropical placemats on my outside table. Yes. And this is like plastic. This You can wipe this down if it gets dirty when it's outside. Yes, I love it. And it's only for me and hubby, so I only got two. No other people invited. <laughs> okay. I also picked up these. These will be these may be for me and Hubby to make our drinks in. These are the drink pouches. I just could not pass these up. I thought they were the cutest. It says sweet summer on them. And they're like little pouches. You put your drinks in them, they have the Ziploc top to them. And they come with the straws. You cannot beat that, y'all. This is just for me and Hubby. But if you were having a party or something like that, you could get, how many comes in a pack, y'all? You get six. So let's say you're having a little party, you get two packs, that's 12, that's enough, people. Um, and then you've got some for everybody. They did have different types, so everybody could have different ones or whatever you wanna do. And then you got your different curling straws. I love it. Picked it up. Last item. Now I saw everybody, these were in the Mother's Day section, I'm guessing, the display. I saw everybody talking about these, but I was like, eh. I, like I told you guys, I don't give Mother's Day gifts. Um, to my sister, I might. Um, but my mother passed away when I was very, very young. So I never really celebrate Mother's Day like that. Um, but this bird just called to me. You know, it can just be used as decor. It does not have to be a Mother's Day gift. I think I'm going to go back and get another one because I love this one. And I'm going to keep it for myself. But my sister will probably want one. So I'll get another one in another color. But just look at, this is just Dollar Tree. For $1.25, y'all are doing the damn thing. That's all I can say. This is gorgeous. And all the other colors were pretty too. I didn't want to buy too many of them. So we'll see what I end up with, you guys. But look at, there's the beak. You know, kind of abstract. Love it. So that's it for today, you guys. That's all I got right now. There's nothing else. It's gone. 
Um, I got to organize everything that I have. I'm going to go on another walkthrough and we will have some hauls. Uh, once I do my walkthrough, which will either be today or tomorrow, then we'll probably start some hauls maybe over the weekend. So just keep watching, you guys. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. I appreciate everything you all are doing for me. Keep watching, y'all. Keep me going. Keep me excited. I'm always going to be excited to shop. But keep me excited to bring it to y'all. Love you guys so, so much. Smooches. And be safe out there, y'all. Bye-bye now.